the DNA that now lives and breathes in all these modern cars, it all began right here. It's an amazing journey of researching these cars. I know people are going to be shocked when we roll the cover off. Bringing this thing back to life has been a real treat. Finding something like this and bringing history back out is just so exciting. I can't think of one person that's got more influence in the collector car world than Craig Jackson. Amazing amount of detective work. And this is interesting here is when Carol said to build the Hornet. The Green Hornet was groundbreaking for the time. We know this is the rear end that went in it. This is quite a find. I mean, to go on the original car to have a, a original piece. This is the way it was on the car. I see it this color, it's gonna be a little bit of a shocker. What's next? It was all experimental. Kind of like an electronic fuel injection. That's the EXP part of it. We're gonna try this, we're gonna try that. Independent rear suspension. Those are the kind of things that make this car so special. They threw a lot of stuff at this car. Everything is as accurate as it can be. This is truly a piece of history. This is the way the car looked originally. Just the attention to detail on the car, seeing it sit the way it should, it's sinister. I don't think I've ever enjoyed watching somebody do burnout so much. <laughs> it was great. <laughs>